What's going on guys, it's Russ, and Borderlands received a huge hotfix that buffed a lot of weapons, and one of those weapons is the Star Helix. So in today's video, I wanted to go over that and talk about how much the buff has done and how it's going to change your gameplay. Now if you don't know, a while back, the Star Helix actually received a buff when all dull assault rifles got a 35% damage increase, and it made it one of the best weapons in the game, but then after its shining period, it started to fall off a little bit, and a lot of people started going towards other weapons. But now it has been buffed again and they increased the damage once more and on the website it doesn't tell you the exact amount but they increased it by a 76 0.4% increase. Now that is a huge increase between the 35% a while back and this 76.4%. The gun should be performing well now and I can happily say yes it is. Honestly it might be one of the better guns in the game. It is very good for mobbing and it also puts out work for bossing. Now before we get too far into it if you don't know the Star Helix is a legendary assault rifle manufactured by Dahl and the red text of the weapon says the stars are better off without us. If you would like to farm for this weapon head over to the Atlas headquarters and farm the power troopers they are the people who drop it so what makes the star helix unique is that it shoots out three bullets at once one bullet is going to go straight like every other normal gun in the game but it also has two bullets to go beside it and go around the main bullet in a s shape since you're shooting three bullets you're going to be doing a lot of damage and this gun has a pretty good fire rate as it is so the dps on this weapon is insane now the star helix can come in radiation cryo kinetic and shock to my knowledge that is the only variants of the gun that you can get so if you're trying to farm grave ward you're not going to have an incentive version but you can make up for that with ASC style anoints. So if you were curious all the gameplay you're seeing is from a pretty generic phase zerker build and it is absolutely shredding. As you can see with a kinetic star helix against grave ward it is taking them out in two clips which is absolutely insane on Mayhem 10 and for mobbing this weapon is just disgusting it straight up can just destroy mobs with ease the three bullets make it absolutely insane and overall it's just a very fun weapon to use i would definitely try to farm for one of these weapons this possibly could become one of the main mobbing weapons in the game as it's standing right now like i said not only is it super fun to use it's super effective and the legendary effect is absolutely insane but that's going to do it for this video if you want to see more videos like this of all the other buff weapons be sure to subscribe and drop a like let me know in the comment section because i would love to make them for you you guys a lot of weapons did receive a buff and a lot of the bad weapons that we used to think are actually performing pretty well now in my opinion the star helix is at the top of that list and you guys should definitely get one but that's gonna be all for me thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next one peace you keep all that drama while i keep my mental healthy staying moving on my solo fishing like the logo climbing a cliff like frodo hope to top street like a rollo only child but i got my brothers tatted on me